Look at that. That was out of one side. Mama. Distraction. Hey. You had three. Yeah. That's enough. We got baby in a bath, a Tunis, and a sock. She's figuring out the escape route as we do. What is going on? <laughs> it's been a day of stillborns. Hi, good girl. Can you say hi to the people? <laughs> Good morning guys. It is Friday. I had to actually think about that today. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Day five of lambing. Full moon yesterday, which means today could be... I thought yesterday would be crazy and it wasn't, so... All right. in there okay if you remember on the bottom, two days ago I think maybe three I aimed for two <laughs> this lamb was knuckled over like this just down here I put a splint and some vet wrap to hold it on just to correct it and it should only take a couple days because I think it's just ligaments it's not like we're dealing with broken bones which is good shouldn't have said that up. so we're just gonna take this off and see So this is the, I basically use the vet wrap, the center, the core of the vet wrap, and then I cut it in half, and then I use it on both sides to splint it straight. Some cast cotton. Look at that. Perfect. All right. Let's do the other one. Oh, wow. You look good. <laughs> hey, can you walk? There we go. Look at that. Straight. Okay, let's go see mom. Let's go see mom. So just before lunch, Carissa told me, uh, we were, I was tagging lambs and she was bottle feeding and she said, we have to watch these, this set of triplets. So it was the set of triplets that was born for her yesterday morning. She said, they all are really drinking a lot out of my bottle. They shouldn't be drinking that much if they're on mom. And I'm like, well, mom's full of milk. But I said, her udder is pretty low and the teats are going straight down instead of to the side. Like you can get away with a bigger udder if the teat placements are more to the side and lambs don't have to work so hard to get at it. We've, we've left two with mom and pulled one off. So what I'm gonna maybe do in the meantime, we'll keep them with mom, we'll keep them in the little pen. I might milk her by hand with my machine for a little bit. Usually if it's in gorge and you milk them off for a few days, they, they start to get better. Uh, so I'm just gonna, I'm gonna attempt to do that at least for a little while till we need those lambing, uh, that lambing spot. It's worst case, it's like, it's low udder plus the teats are going straight down and the lambs are big. So those three, those three things all together makes for kind of a nightmare. <laughs> A lot easier with him.
Okay. So, that was worth doing. That was out of one side. I don't know if she'll let me do the other, but we're gonna try. Okay, which one did I do? Did I do this one? I did this one, right? Did I do the other one? Did that one. I did the other one. There. That's better. And look at that. Unbelievable. Can you? That's unreal. Teamwork. Nice. Say hi to the people. <laughs> Come here. Oh, you are beautiful. Yeah, Morning guys, it's Saturday, day six of lambing. Yesterday there was no lambs. So what's up, yous? Come on. Almost two babies. This is Carissa's favorite you. Hi, sweetie. Did you have a baby? Or are you stealing? Yeah. Have a baby coming out. Just have your own baby. Mama. Okay, let's try the sled. Oh, the sled's okay. Come on, Mama. Distraction. Hey. That's right, it's over. Oh, yeah? You haven't had your baby yet. Oh. Slimy, slimy. There you go, Mama. Good girl. You're ready. Welcome. Yeah, it's quite the entrance. There you go. There we go. How are you feeling? Good girl. Okay, you drank 50. That's good. You are pretty weak. You are. Okay. This one might need warmed up. Work on your lambs, please. Okay, well, I'm going to let Mom clean them off and try to feed them in an hour. They are not drinking well. This one drank. You had a drink off, Mom? Ooh. How about you, bud? Yeah. Well done. Want the rest? You're a sweetheart. You're a good mommy.
Hey, what are you doing? Like, that's not really how this works. Well, this means only one thing. You've got another layer to come in. And you had three. Yeah. Is that enough? Oh, what's going on here? Of course, this one's backwards, is it? That's perfect. Very orange, Mama. There you go. There you go. I think you're off to the races now. I'm gonna get some straw for you guys. Yeah. I don't know about this one. I might warm you up. We got baby in a bath. We'll do this first. I'll get a towel. And then I'll check the temp and go from there. It's shivering now. I don't know if that's good or bad. This seems to work good though. We got it to 35.2. So we're gonna warm it up a little bit. See if it'll warm up on its own to 37. I'll check it in a bit. If it doesn't, then we might have to use dextrose. Always when I'm distracted, we have some beautiful things happen. What did you do, mom? What you got over there? <gasps> Another Tunis. Oh, you are huge. Let's go for a walk. Come on, Mom. I'm going to have to take your legs, sweet. And it is another boy. Mamas. It is the year of the boy. Well, we have stepbrothers. Because uh, this breeding group, I had the two Tunises together and Lucky, the Suffolk. And we definitely have a Tunis and a Suffolk. <laughs> I wondered if this would happen. Oh, look who's making noise already! Hi! You look a little perkier. Oh, goodness me! I think that's the trick. Oh, you're fogging up my camera. It works so good. Do you want a drink? Let's take your temp. Okay, we're almost there. Mm, 36.2. So we will... We're going to snuggle you up a little bit more, okay? i got to bind him up so he doesn't try to get out. I keep calling it a he. I actually don't know. That's better. Well... I came back to feed Lucky, and Mama had another trick up her sleeve. <laughs> Come here. It's a girl! Outnumbered there, Lucky. Yeah, you are. Yeah, you're darn cute, Joe. Oh, Here. Just so Mommy doesn't forget about you. Here you go. I have already had a wardrobe change and I need to change again. It has, it has been a crazy Saturday and this is what I get because there's no lambs yesterday. This is my payback. Look at my lamb. Hi buddy. Hi. What are you even? I didn't even, oh you're a girl. Goody. Let's see ya, how are you doing? Can you walk? Of course I got another 100 mils into it so it's had its serving which is good. I could put it back with mom, but mom doesn't have enough milk anyway, so I might just I might just keep you out, okay? I'll build you a little area over here. Where are you going? I made you a nice little bed. Then you peed. Now you're trying to escape. Once again, grocery store run, lambs on the ground. It's like a trigger, they know. Set of twins, it looks like. There's their three. Mm. Hi, big mama. Oh, my God. 
driving up. Uh, yeah. 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 Have to go. <laughs> Early? I So you're a troublemaker. Oh, you have teeth! You have teeth! Oh. <laughs> Good morning. My little buddy says hello. She broke out this morning, actually. She's figuring out the escape route, as we do. You little monkey. That's not your baby. Hi, buddy. I think mama's looking for you. Yes. There's your baby. There you go. Okay. What is going on? Good morning. It's Sunday if I didn't say good morning before. Uh, we're on day seven. And this is the first morning of grossness. We had three stillborns on the ground. Two ewes that have lambed. And one little lamb that no one is claiming. I think it's this one's? But it might be hers. And it's not a shy lamb. It wants everybody to be its mom. So I'm gonna see if this mom in the corner wants it since this little Suffolk is not interested. Will you have this as your baby? There you go. I'm gonna grab it. I think I chose the right one. Yesterday was finally busy. You're doing much better. I got it. No worries. You just relax. You just drop some milk. <laughs> Nothing? Okay. This lady ended up, she did have two of the three stillborns, and the other one had the one stillborn. Her two have that 
horrendous smell that the one that uh, lambed first in the last group, like rotten, like a smell I can't even describe. It's so bad. So something was going on with her for sure. It's a shame. She's still calling for them. Mama just laid down fast, almost on her lamb. I wonder if she's maybe having another one. We're gonna see. She indeed had another one. Very stuck. So, I think we're lucky we have one. This morning has been going from bad to worse. We had a ewe that just had quads, three of them stillborn, so it's, it's been a day of stillborns. This mama is in labor, and there's a tail. A tail is poking out, which is never good. So, I believe we have a backwards lamb. So small. Something's going on. Two. That one's alive. There's no way. Are you alive? Oh, you are. Little black, you little baby. Oh, be alive, be alive, be alive. Be alive. Hi. Are you alive? And you're a girl. Come on, buds. Oh, no. You're too early. Look how little they are. I know, a billy. It's a billy. They're barely alive. This one's not. But they're like so small. Like, why? Good girl. Hey, come on, Billy girl. Come on, you guys. These lambs are tiny. So tiny. Probably two weeks early, I'm guessing, or a week, maybe a week. So little Billy is showing the, the best signs of life. This one, I don't think so. And then this one, of course, was the backwards one and it never had a heartbeat. So today is just uh, not great. I did the uh, lamb in a bag bath and we have it all wrapped up on the heating pad. It's already kind of gasping, so I don't think there's much hope, but we'll see. Okay, I'm going with my gut on this one. Mama hasn't really been paying much attention to my little Billy. So I brought her in here too. Now her temp is still okay, but she was starting to shiver and I just don't want her to go backwards. So she's just gonna hang out with this little turd. 